have never done a food shop at Iceland before. I've popped into Iceland and bought ice creams or I've bought pizzas and I've got things in Iceland, um, but they've always been a one-off. I've never done a proper like weekly shop in Iceland because I guess I always thought it didn't really do everything that I needed. So the lovely people at Channel Mum and Iceland gave us some vouchers to go and do a food shop at Iceland to see what we could get. And I must say, I was so surprised. They do do more than ice cream and pizza. One of the biggest things I was really shocked to find was this, lobster, yep. They do lobster, um, so uncooked Canadian lobster tails, and they look amazing. Um, so I wouldn't normally buy lobster in my weekly shop, but it is my birthday this week, so I thought, you know, why not splash out? The other thing that I kind of treated myself to and was really shocked that they had was this Prosecco. Yeah, honey, you're not be eating this or drinking this until you're a bit bigger. But yeah, they do Prosecco, and this was less than seven points. So actually, they do stuff for baby stuff. Nurofen, I would never, ever have thought that I could have got Nurofen in there. And it was only as I, as I was walking past the shelves that I saw it and thought, wow. Um, so yeah, always good to have, because she is a teething at the moment, or we're starting to teethe. Um, so yeah, we definitely need lots of this. I'll stop blabbering now and actually show you some of the food that I bought got this half aromatic crispy duck. Uh, I love crispy duck from the Chinese. I've never made it at home, but this says it's simple to cook, so I thought I'd try it out. We also love salmon and, well, fish generally. <laughs> By the way, that is my four month old who is um, just over here. Hello. <laughs> so uh, you may hear a few random noises throughout this because she's just found her voice. But yeah, so we got some salmon fillets, salmon parcels, the lobster I've already mentioned. <laughs> That's lovely, Sienna. Got some sweet potato fries, which I've heard really good reports about. Then something that I was amazed to find, and my hubby was even more amazed to find, Wagyu burgers. So we can't wait to try them on the barbecue. And speaking of barbecuing, we also got these chorizo, chicken and chorizo kebabs. And we want to also try and do the pulled pork on the barbecue as well. We also got some garlic and chili king prawn kebabs love prawns then on to some pizzas now these are award-winning pizzas and i have tried these before i've bought these before and honestly they're so good then i got some um frozen sweet potato mash and normal mash now these are things i probably would never have in the past thought i would try but i watched a channel mom video where a couple of the girls had made mash with them and raved about it so i was like right i'll give it a go and uh, why not and if it means also it'll last longer in the freezer even better then these chips look amazing oh so they are mars piper chunky oven chips also got these broccoli and cauliflower creamy gratins which i think i might have with the lobster and then some ice cream cones because we love ice cream and it's coming into the summer. The chicken and chorizo style uh, sausage paella. And uh, just thought that'd be something quick and easy to have in the summertime for a lunch. So then on to stuff for the fridge. We've got some fruit, got apples, strawberries are there. And we've got some veg, some carrots, some broccoli, some little potatoes, hummus, because um, we like that as a little snack tomato and mascarpone sauce to go with the pasta which is over here some pasta milk the prosecco some salad and um, some little yogurts for sophia and some ham stuff i was really surprised by is just how much they do that's also like for the cupboard um so i got bread rice got some honey which is really good some other bread but I, these were two for a pound as well i love thins they're so good and they're perfect for sophia for her lunches some chocolate um you know for a wee snack then some mars piper potatoes got some marmalade and uncle ben's sauce to make a uh, chili and some carbonara sauce for some pasta. And actually even the best thing about with the Uncle Ben's, I got the sauce and I got the two rices. I got a free walk. Like how cool is that? So I'll get loads of use out of that. So yeah, free walk if you get down there now. Um, then also got some Heinz beans. Uh, again, Sophia loves those. Some special frozen, um, and there's also Star Wars. Um, Kellogg's cereal. Some other cereal because we go through cereal at some rate and then the best thing of all is just what they how much they do as well that's like not not just food but other stuff and um, i didn't need any nappies but they do do nappies and then but i did need wipes so i got some wipes 
got some um, body lotion or shower cream, sorry. And uh, that was only a pound, I think, as well, or even 99p. And then the Neurofen, which I've already mentioned. That all came to £111. Considering I got so much, including lobster and Prosecco, I think that's really, really good price and hopefully it'll last me ages. Here is one of the finished meals. We have the Wagyu burger, some potatoes, the pulled pork, and even a little bit of lobster and it looks absolutely gorgeous. So I'm off to enjoy this now with a nice glass of Prosecco. And overall, I must say, I'm really, really impressed with what I was able to get. And I was really surprised by a lot of it. And it's not just frozen and it's not just ice creams and pizzas. Woohoo! Actually, the thing I'm surprised about most is the fact that I think my husband is now converted as well. He's always been very into it's got to be only fresh. And um, he likes everything cooked from scratch. But he was really impressed when he saw everything that we got. Yeah, we've converted him. And I'm sure we will definitely be doing another weekly shop at Iceland. So where do you shop? Leave any comments below, maybe some tips if you shop in Iceland is there anything amazing that I missed leave it all below also you can get more tips and sort of grocery hauls and menu ideas and things like that um, on this website it'll appear here hopefully and I'll also put the link in the comment section below and as always yeah if you like this video please like and uh, also subscribe and I'll be back very soon